Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. This is Miss Lisa, and today I have a DIY crochet video for you guys. This is the braid pattern I chose because I want to have full hair. So what I did was put a part in the middle and braid two cornrows down the side of my hairline. Today I decided to purchase the Epic 100% Premium Quality Hair. It is 1B Hot Red. It's layered. It's 52 inches. It comes with three bundles. I love the flow. I love the texture of this hair. So, yeah, this is the hair I decided to buy. It was $4.99 at my local beauty supply. So, yeah, this is the hair. Okay, so you guys, I'm going to start with the front end of my hair. Because I know a lot of guys, a lot of you guys run out of hair coming up to the top if you start in the back. So today I'm going to decide to start with the top of my hair. I'm going to use smaller pieces in the front to fill in the front and then I'm going to fill in the back with much bigger pieces. The closer I get to the edge of the stocking cap, the closer I get to my forehead and the edge of the stocking cap, I'm going to make those pieces really, really mini micro teeny. The cap that I purchased that I'm using is a regular cap from my local beauty supply, except that it had a hole in the top. When I got home, I was completely shocked about this hole because I had never purchased a stocking cap with a hole in the top, so that was a total shock to me. So what I did was I turned the stocking upside down because I did not want the band around the edge of my hair because my edges are thin. So I turned it upside down, and I measured it, and I placed the pin in it, took it off, I sewed it up, sewed the hole up with my mini sewing machine, then I cut off the excess, I flipped it inside out, and I turned it upside down. I wanted the softer edge of the cap on my hairline, because my hairline is very, very thin. The hairline and the top of my head is very thin. So that's exactly where the white string is coming from. So I hope this DIY tutorial, crochet, braiding tutorial video help you guys out. The ones that want that full look but have thinning hair. This is what this video is for. For you guys. Because I have the same thing. And I want you to achieve the fullness that you desire when it comes to crochet braids. So I hope this helps you guys out because it helps me out. And if you if you want to know what the end results look like, stick around. I am crocheting the hair up under my pillow and through the neck. And within the parts, I am going to only crochet up under the neck area to fill in the parts areas that is very thin. So I hope I made that very clear. I'm gonna continue crocheting up under my cornrow and the neck at the same time. And once I finish doing that, I'm also going to fill in the empty spaces under the neck only so I won't so I can prevent any snagging of my hair. I did snag my hair a couple of times, so I prevented that by lifting the neck some so I won't get under those really really tiny tiny pieces and snag. So yeah you guys this is another DIY crochet video but I'm just using a different method I haven't seen this method I looked on YouTube for it and I decided that I wanted to show you guys how I achieved this full look. And I hope you guys enjoy this video. And if you want to go ahead and skip ahead to the end to see the finished look, you can go ahead or you can continue watching me crochet my entire head. I did not slow any parts down. I sped them all up so that the video won't be super long and I made and I cut out some parts so that the video wouldn't be super long so you guys I hope you enjoyed this video 
Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And if you have any comments or concerns, leave a comment down below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.
yeah you guys this is the final look it is thick in the front thick in the back I am loving this hair it is nice and flowy it is no spots missing I love it I was able to if you know how to do the no knot or the invisible part method that could really help with your front line I'm not good at it but if you know how to do it you go girl I am loving this hair <laughs> so yeah if you like this video if you like this method leave a like and I'll see you in the next video